Welcome back to my channel. It's Roro here, and we are here with another freaking video. So on today's video, we're gonna be talking about some things that I picked up from Amazon that I think smells amazing, really cool, that I feel like that you need to get into your collection. Um, on this channel, we talk about everything that smells good, look good, and make you feel good. A lot of times I do talk about fragrances, but I will be opening up my, you know, my, my um, channel up to doing like more clothing hauls and stuff like that. So be on the lookout for that. So if you like this type of content, anything with perfume, clothing, just basically girly stuff just subscribe and like the video um, give it a big thumbs up and if you like this kind of content just keep on watching so yeah welcome back to my channel so um lately your girl has been shopping and been shopping crazy because fall is coming up and we all know we love us some fall we love us you know, fall is a time where you literally can bring out all your vanillas, your fragrances that you've been waiting for a long time that's too strong to wear like in the colder months or whatever, because some scents really do smell better in the colder months. Um, some stuff is just like too strong for the, um, for the spring and summer or whatever. So I'm just gonna show you guys some stuff that I picked up from Amazon, some stuff I picked up um, from Target. Native came out with some body washes for the fall and y'all know I had to go and get them. So um, I have all of these here. You're gonna see me reaching over it because I have some stuff on my bed. Um, so you're gonna see me reaching over for some stuff. So let me adjust my camera real quickly. All right. Sorry. All right, so let's get into the video. So um, if you're wondering what's on my lip, it's Ruby Woo by MAC. Um, I know you guys are probably gonna ask in the comment. Uh, my jacket is from Shein or whatever. So let's just get straight into the video. So um, I'm just gonna show you guys some fragrances that I got from Amazon and um, some body washes and stuff that I picked up from Target and any of the knickknacks that I just picked up. Um, or whatever i'll show you all right so the first thing oh yeah and i did pick up some stuff from tj maxx and ross so i'll show you guys that in the video as well um or whatever so let's just get into it all right so on today's video um native came out with like four different body washes i want to say i think one of the body washes is already old um but again it's fall so I picked up another one because I already had it in my connection, like the coconut and vanilla. Um, so yeah, let's 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 just let me stop rambling and start showing you the product. So the first thing that I got was yeah, I was looking on Amazon and yeah, I did not know Nivea had came out with a vanilla and sweet cream um, body wash, and this is what it looks like. It was only three dollars, so your girl picked it up. Sorry, y'all, my baby in the background. Sorry, yeah, my baby was in the background. But anyways, um, this is the vanilla and cream and sweet cream body wash by Nivea. I have used it already, and it um, it do smell like ooh, vanilla um and cream or whatever. So if you don't have this in your collection, please go and get it. I don't know if it's in stores, but I did buy it off of Amazon, so um, that's where I found it. So and this is what the packaging looks like. Um, the next thing that I got from, from, um, Target was this coconut and vanilla native body wash or whatever. I do have this in my collection, a small one, as y'all can see, I love native. So, um, but I wanted to pick up another one just because I want the big one and I love the big packaging from native. I love native. If y'all can tell by down here about my collection. I love Native. Native is one of the body washes that I buy the most because I just loves it to love it because to me, it just keeps my body clean and they smell good and they're supposed to be all natural. So yeah, I love Native. The next thing that I got The next thing that I got was this cashmere and rain. Y'all, this is like a fresh, um, it's like a fresh, I used this one already too. 
it's like a fresh um scent body wash or whatever it's really really fresh if you like fresh scents i know um eos came out with a lotion called cozy and something i didn't pick it up because i'm not like a fresh scent girl i really do like to smell very feminine um i do have like two fresh scents which is um dose and gabbana light blue and um machino that's the only fresh scent that i have but if you do like fresh um, I do recommend you going to pick up this Cashmere and Rain by Native. It do smell good. It's very, very fresh, like really, really fresh. Um, there's no notes on here. So um, it says the scent, the fragrance is Cashmere and Rain. Um, so if you like the sense of like Cashmere and freshness, I do recommend you getting this. Um, Y'all, this, I love you Native, but this stank. Okay, yeah, it's just not giving, and I love Native. I buy every Native thing that comes out. I have their deodorant, their body wash. The only thing I don't have is their shampoo. Um, but yeah, I I wash with this, and I was like, uh, I'm gonna return it because I don't like it at all. Um, but if you're a warm cider and cinnamon person, go get it um just not for me because that's not the sense that i like um but if you you know if you like this type of scent you know do your thing and native brought it out it's an apple cider um and a cinnamon scent it just was not doing it for me it's i don't even know what it smells like to me i just i just don't like it but this right here is dear to my heart this is toasted marshmallow and vanilla <laughs> um it smells so good Oh, it smells so good. It smells like s'mores. This is exactly what it smells like. Um, yeah, it smells like s'mores. That's what it smells like. It smells really good. It's the vanilla, um, the marshmallow, you know, the, amp I mean, the, <sighs> Lord help me. Y'all get what I'm trying to say. But yeah, this is it right here. It smells, it smells really good. If you, if you like, um, vanilla and marshmallow scents and, um, and creamy and stuff like that you want to go pick this up because it really do smells really really good the next thing that i picked up from target was this method body acai mulberry gohi berry berry balance body wash i have all the native um not native method body body washes too i'll do a video on all the ones that i have um and this one i was missing from my collection because it was sold out every time i wanted to get it so um i did want to pick this up and i finally found it at target um i picked it up it was like 7.99 and i do like it i love it it smells really really good it smells like berries it smells um you know it's a side if you know what a side is yeah it smells like berry a little bit of rose in it i do like it i do enjoy using it um i'm glad to have it in my collection because that was the only one that i was missing from the method body line i'm not sure if they came out with anything new when i went to target they didn't have anything new so if, i have to check on honestly if they came out with anything new um and this is what it looks like so yeah um the next thing that i got was um from bath and body works was this aromatherapy um cedar wood, cedar wood and yingling um body wash from their aromatherapy line and it smells really really good i'm not a big fan of the aromatherapy line um but i did like this and i had picked up a vanilla one but i don't know where i put the vanilla one the 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 vanilla something but i did pick it up i don't remember where i put it i know because when i buy my stuff i really don't just leave them laying around i put them up and then when i make videos i put them all back together but um i can't remember where i put this but this one is the refresh your body and this one is um yeah it don't have a a note or anything but i'm guessing the notes is cedar and yingling um body wash so this is it right here Alrighty. Um, and another thing that I picked up was, and I don't already already use them up, child. So can't go wrong with baby lotion. I don't know why I didn't have baby lotion in my collection, but I finally picked some up. I picked up the small one. If y'all go in Walmart or Target, they got like that little section with all the small little knickknacks that you need or whatever. So I wanted to pick this one up, especially with my kids on the go. I be trying to um. You know make sure i have stuff and then i picked up the body oil so this is the body oil y'all i don't use this body oil up because i love baby oil and stuff like that so 
I picked up these two. And so another few things that I picked up at um, Walmart was these Body Fantasy little sprays. I thought they were so cute. Now, am I gonna use them? I don't even know, but I did just pick them up because I have the body sprays, but I wanted to pick up these little ones. I thought they were really, really cute. And this one is in the scent Fresh Musk. And somebody said, if you like Giorgio, you'll love, I said, somebody said, what? It says, if you like Georgia, you'll love Primo. And this is the body spray. And I picked up these two, which was really, really cute. And I'm happy to have them in my little collection or whatever. Um, these are at Walmart. I think they were like $2 or $3. I'm not sure. But I picked them up because, you know, addicts, that's what they do. They pick up things they don't need. But <laughs> this is it right here. Um, so I picked up some perfume from Amazon. Um, y'all, if you're on TikTok, you know TikTok has been raving about this perfume right here. It's called The Beautiful Life. And I want to say it's a dupe for La Vie Belle because, I mean, it's called The Beautiful Life. La Vie Belle means beautiful life. So I guess they rewind it and put it in English versus French, whatever, whatever they were doing. I like it. I think it smells really good. It smells really good. Um, I tried looking up the notes for this perfume. I could not find it. But if you're on Amazon and want to pick it up and don't want to drop the 122 for um, La Via Belle, you can get this one. It's, so, it's, such, it's such a pretty scent. It's, it's very um, feminine. It's very pretty. You smell the berries in there, a little bit of vanilla, um, a little bit of must too. Um, it's very, very pretty. But um, La Via Belle is one of my favorite perfumes, like literally my top five. So when somebody said this was supposed to be like a dupe or something for it, I ran and got it because why not? Um, I think on Amazon, I bought this for like 22 or $29. Don't quote me because child, when things go viral on TikTok, for whatever reason, the prices jump from $10 to $30 in seconds. So if I said it's 29 and you go in there, it's more, I'm so sorry, but I did not get it for more than $30. I'm not even going to lie, but I like it. It smells good. It's in my collection. And as you can see, I started wearing it or whatever. So if you see it and want it, this is what the bottle looks like. Go and get it. So yeah, if you again have been on TikTok, you notice people been raving about this and y'all, this is, um, yeah, I couldn't wait to get it in my collection. It's beautiful. It is the Casablanca from Swiss Arabian. It's the Eder perfume. Um, Y'all, this perfume smells so good. Um, it's like an apple caramel scent um, or whatever. And y'all, let's get into it. This is the packaging, this is the box, and ooh, this is the bottle. This is the perfume, it is so pretty. The bottle is so pretty. You can find it on Amazon, and I think Jam Shop has it too. Don't quote me, I think they have it. Um, I love it, I've sprayed it. Um, it's a caramel with a, um, vanilla um, spice. Gourmand, like if you like gourmand, if you like apple, if you like fruit, even with a little bit of um, vanilla, you want to go and snatch this. It smells really, really good. The bottle is absolutely beautiful. I'm going to post the notes somewhere up here because I didn't put the whole notes and I don't have my other phone um, to look it up for you guys. But I will put it up on the screen so you can know. And I'll put the link down below if you want to purchase it. Um, and this is what it looks like. They have the Casablanca right here. Um, and... This is it. Ooh, that thing smells good. And it lasts a long time too. I had already um, sprayed it or whatever. I had wore it out. Oh, y'all, it smells so good. Like you really can smell the apple and the caramel. I don't care what nobody says. This, you can smell the apple and the caramel. I heard some people say you can. Yes, you can. You can smell it. Well, I can smell it. I can smell it. And a lot of people that I know have this can smell it too. So. Yeah, Casablanca is that girl. She, you know, she needs to be hyped up more. Um, honestly, I've been hearing a lot about Swiss Arabian and I'm trying to get into more of their perfumes. I'm not a really strong perfume girl. Perfume is, yeah. <laughs> if you are 
a, I don't know what class you are. I'm class of two, 2006. So if you're class of 06 and you started wearing perfume in high school, you'll definitely know about this perfume. When I started my first collection, um, this was one of my staples. I love True Religion and I love their perfume. So I had this in my collection and then I lost it. And I was so happy because I was trying to find it on Macari. I was trying to find it everywhere. And people were like taxing. I was like, I'm not paying a hundred dollars for this perfume. Like, are you serious? And I went to Florida and boom, I walked into their Ross and it was right there waiting on me. So I had to pick her up. It was like two and I picked up one. I made the girl hold one actually because child, they, long, they lines be so long. I was like, I'm not waiting in this line. So I went and got it like when they were nearly closing. But yeah, this is the True Religion Hippie Chick. Um, y'all, this is one of my favorite perfumes when I started collecting perfume. I started kept collecting perfume in high school. My mom used to sell Avon, so shout out to Avon. Um, my mom used to sell Avon and that's how I got into um, collecting perfume or whatever. And when I started going out and buying perfume and stuff, so I started getting my own little stuff. And this was one of the ones that I had got and I'm so happy I did. Um, and this is what the bottle looks like. It's such a pretty bottle. I remember last time I bought it, it came with like a little chain or whatever, but this time it didn't come with the little chain. Sorry, y'all, my lashes is um, bothering me. Um, this is what the bottle looks like. It's a vanilla. Again, I'm gonna drop the notes up top here because I don't know off the top of my head, but I know it is a vanilla and a um, floral and a citrus type of scent. Ooh. Y'all, this perfume has not, I, it literally smells exactly how I remember it smelled when I was in high school. And I'm just so happy that I was able to get my hands on this perfume or whatever to have it back in my collection. Um, I will, I'm still looking for the other True Religion, the one that's kind of like um, grayish looking with the big simple right here that say True Religion. I'm still looking for that. Um, and I can't wait till I find it. So this is True Religion Hippie Chick. If you don't have it, I recommend you to go get it. And look, I just mixed it with the Casablanca. <laughs> it's giving, okay? It smells so good. But yeah, this is True Religion, um, Hippie Chick. Um, and y'all, I'm so happy because I just feel like, you know, like a kid again. I graduated in 2006, so that's like what? 20, 22, 16 years. Oh my God. 16 years so yeah i'm happy with it i'm happy to have bring it back to my collection and yeah. all right so i went to marshall's no tj maxx i don't have a marshall's here a tj maxx and then i have picked up a perfume um it's called it's called floral boom um I looked on Google to see what the notes were on this perfume and I didn't find any, but it's such a pretty bottle. It's such a white, it's a white bottle with like this little um, satchel on the side or whatever. It's like a, I wore it the other day. Not the other day, the day that I purchased it, I did put it on or whatever. Let me spray it on my hand so I could try to see. Um, I know I smelled vanilla, like vanilla was very, very, very very potent on this but this has a lot of alcohol like i really can smell the alcohol i don't really smell smell the perfume until it like dries down and i don't like that but when i do when it does dry down it do has like a, um you can smell the vanilla in there you can smell the floral i don't know what other um what other notes is in here i'm gonna keep trying to look if i find it i will um post it up here somewhere or in the description but um this is a perfume right here the bottle is really really pretty i don't know if i'm gonna keep it yet because it's really pretty but i don't like the opening of so much alcohol if that makes sense but it is really it's a really pretty bottle um especially if you have teenagers and you want to start their collection don't be scared to go to tj maxx and stuff to start a kid's collection i started my daughter collection she's 12 and a lot of the stuff that i got from her was tj maxx marshall's walmart and stuff like that so if you want to start your daughter a nice cute collection please go to walmart tj maxx marshall's and stuff and pick them perfumes because they're still like young in school and stuff they don't need to be smelling 
overly adulty you know um and these perfumes right here comes in handy because you know they can take them to school and keep you know spray them and stuff like that when they go out you know they smell good you know when they go to school they smell good i'm, I'm getting my daughter on this new you know a whole level of hygiene and smelling good and stuff like that so i started collecting her some you know body care and stuff like that if y'all want me to do a video on um my daughter's collection or whatever i would be more than happy to do that for y'all and show y'all what i got in her collection so this is flower boom if i don't keep this for me if i don't return it i will give it to my daughter but i'm still debating um because i do like it it does smell good like now that i sprayed it and it dried down it does smell really really good like it do smell good so maybe i'll keep it maybe i won't i'll let y'all know i'll keep y'all posted i'll wear it for a day like all over me to see how long it lasts and then i can debate if i'm gonna keep it or not so this is flower boom um bloom my bad not boom bloom um and i got it for tj from tj maxx and it was 14.99 so y'all another perfume that i had got i put um i already had put it up but i'm gonna snatch it real quick from amazon is um is fancy y'all remember fancy i remember in high school i had bought this one too and this was like a high school fave of mine that i wanted in my collection um and child i love fancy like it smells so good i don't like the one in the white bottle but i love this one and y'all this is one of my favorite perfumes i feel like it don't get hyped enough like jessica simpson definitely did her thing with this um fancy perfume and it is still a staple and it still smells good and it still oh it still smells the same just vanilla and just inviting and just beautiful it's such a beautiful scent it wasn't in any stores that i went to so i got it on amazon for like 20 dollars, and this is like i think the, the this is a 1.7 ounce dang it's big um and i'm so happy that i got it in my collection with um true religion i'm still looking for some of my old high school perfumes or whatever but so many has been discontinued and it's been years um so i'm still looking for like the old mark jacob like the lola the purple one with the big flower on the top i know i picked up dot i already did that in one of my videos which is right here um so yeah if y'all know anywhere where i can get some of my high school perfumes i really would like to add them to my collection and you know just have them and stuff like that you know for memories because child we love to smell like our old days sometimes and just you know reminisce on being a kid and not just you know when we first started collecting perfume and just started getting into our scents and stuff that we like and stuff like that so yeah so this is the end of the video if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up um comment down below what your scent of the day is i didn't have a scent of the day uh because you know i was showing y'all these perfumes but i guess my scent of the day now is jessica simpson's casablanca and all of these perfume mix so if you like this um, type of content don't forget to subscribe share it with your friends and let me know what you think about it let me know what kind of video that you would want me to keep recording for you guys and i'll be so happy to do to do so so with that all being said and done i'll see you guys in my next video bye